What's up everyone, it's Sarah here bringing you another daily glitch and bring today's top news stories. Ubisoft is working hard to promote the next game in the Assassin's Creed franchise, Assassin's Creed Syndicate. With a release date just under two months away, Ubisoft is looking to tease as much as possible of the upcoming game. Today we saw a new trailer released to the masses, and this one focuses on the DLC. It was confirmed that if you pre-order the game, you will get free access to the Charles Dickens and Charles Darwin storyline. Based on the DLC teaser trailer, it looks like you will be joining forces with the duo to help sort some major issues out, face off against your greatest fears, and some threatening plots as you uncover the Darwin and Dickens conspiracy. But never fear, as I'm sure a lot of you are not too keen on picking up the pre-order bonus right away thanks to last year's Unity catastrophe. Even if you skip out on pre-ordering to wait for reviews and gameplay, you still have the option of picking up the DLC pack at a later date. Of course, it will be at a cost. An interesting thing about this announcement is that it did showcase the release date, which is October 23rd. Despite the trailer showing off the PC as a playable platform, PC gamers will not have access to Assassin's Creed Syndicate on the 23rd. Instead, the PC will be releasing worldwide on November 19th. I'm sure this is raising some red flags for PC fans who are still having nightmares about the faceless bugs from Unity, and it seems that Ubisoft also is on the same page. In response to this announcement, the studio production manager was quick to soothe over fears, stating that the development team is dedicated to ensuring PC players will get the most stable, optimized version of the game on day one. The PC optimization and stabilization has been one of the top priorities for the development team this year. Even with their new process that will focus on the PC, they still feel the extra four weeks after the console release will allow them the time they needed to ensure that the game will be stable for all systems on launch. Their goal is for a smooth running title on day one, especially for their PC fan base. We still have yet to get a finalized PC requirement list, but there are promises for no locks on the game for frame rate and resolution. So what do you think about this delay? Is it a good thing that they are taking the extra time after last year, or is it raising a few red flags and concerns? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. And if you are looking for additional glitch feed coverage on Assassin's Creed Syndicate, go check out our interview with the team during RTX. We had the chance to check out the black box mission revealed at Gamescom firsthand, and went over a lot of the newly revealed details on the title. And that is another day of gaming news. If you like what you heard, make sure to let us know with a like or leaving a comment below. You also can subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on the top news stories each and every day. Join us again tomorrow for another Daily Glitch.